What's up, YouTube? With Legendary FIFA back with another video today. So I have a brand new poster, Ronaldo poster. It's a little bit old, so it's actually not brand new. I've had it in my room for a long, long time, but I never actually hung it up. Let me know if you guys like that new addition to the wall. Also, if you have anything that you want me to put in the wall, like any posters or any players specifically, leave it in the comments down below, because maybe, you know, I, I'm always down for upgrading my room and stuff like that, so just let me know. So today, we're going to be reviewing the brand new League SBC, Yannick Carrasso. So he's not brand new but he is relatively new and I looked at Footbin about five minutes ago and his SBC is going for around 115,000 coins. You can choose between either Yannick Carrasco, Oscar or Renato Augusto. So in my opinion, I think it's decent because they upgraded him three ratings, but it's really weird how some of these ratings work, like for the league SBCs. For example, in the Premier League SBC, Decore and, why did I say it like that? Decore and Jamie Vardy are both 81 rated overalls, and then they upgraded them both to 86 overalls. And then for this SBC, they only upgraded the, uh, Carrasco three, like only three ratings. I don't understand who does this or who makes it work. Like for, in, in my opinion, I feel like these cards should definitely be more usable, like higher rated. Maybe Carrasco should be 88 rated to make them actually, for, for people to actually go and desire the SBCs and actually want to try out and use these cards. But then again, that's probably the reason as to why they're so cheap. 115,000 coins, and he'd be a lot cheaper, but that team Henan GI, or however you pronounce it, is going for like 30, 40,000 coins itself. So if you can snipe silvers and get it for cheaper, or get them from uh, silver packs or wherever, whatever method you guys want to use to get the players for cheaper, go for it, have fun. But I'm going to let you know if this Carrasco card is actually worth it or not. So let's jump and take a look at his in-game stats. So he has 91 pace, 85 shooting, 80 passing, 89 dribbling, 43 defending and 68 physical. So his pace looks good, his passing looks good, and his shooting also looks good. He's five foot eleven, which is a good height. He's got high medium work rates, which is going to be good for a cam. You could probably even play him as a striker, which is what I'm going to try him out in. He's got uh, he's got a right. He's on not he's got a right foot. Everyone has a right foot, but he's right footed. He's got four star weak foot and four star skills. As you guys can see, no games played, no goals, no assists because there's no games played. Now let's take a look at his in game stats. So his pace looks incredible. Good pace, right? Shooting, 88 attack positioning is incredible. Finishing, 86 is good. We're going to definitely add a chem style to boost up probably his shooting stats and maybe physical stats as well. So, shot power looks insane. 91 with the plus 4 because of the base kick chem style. He's got 81 shooting, 81 long shots, 74 volleys, and 80 penalties. So, those are a little bit low, but then again, it's not the end of the world. Vision could definitely be higher. Crossing is decent. Free kick accuracy is decent. Short pass, decent. Long pass, not that great, but curve is great. Excuse me, goddamn. It's like a it's a common theme that I keep burping in these videos. So he's got insane dribbling, 91 agility. Bounce is a little bit low, but I think his agility will definitely make up for that. 85 reactions is awesome. 90 ball control, 91 dribbling is insane. Composure at 77 is just a little bit low. Interceptions, we're not even gonna look into those defending stats because literally you could vomit looking at those interceptions interception stats because they're that bad but his physical stats he's got 72 jumping 78 stamina 62 aggression and 64 or 62 strength and 64 aggression so his card definitely looks really well rounded like like in the offensive part like pace shooting passing is pretty decent dribbling but when it comes to physical stats definitely not the best so let's take a look at what uh chem style we could put on him before i do that i want to mention the fact that i've been using diego simeone as my managers even if he gets no chemistry from my teams because of what he did against juventus with the uh I'm sorry, Ronaldo, but like you, you guys know what I'm talking about. You, you you know what he did, but that like when he celebrated. Just for those of you who don't know, when you want to go look it up. But let's take a look at what kind of style we can put on this card. So I would definitely want to improve his physical stats because they're really really low. Question is, do I want to max out like his shooting or his dribbling? That's the real question. So we could put a sniper on him, shooting and dribbling. But do we want him to be faster? Shooting and physical could be a decent one because he's already got really good dribbling. I think I'm going to use this one. Shooting and physical, we'll put a finisher on him. Because if we're going to play him at striker, might as well. His passing is already really, really decent. So I think today I'm going to jump into another live com game. All right, so let's take a look at our next opponent. So, by the way, this is Foot Champions. We're not going into Div Rivals. Foot Champions, we're going to go all in or all out. So, he's got, wow, that headliner Arnardovich looks sick. I haven't used him. I heard he's really good, though. I haven't come up against him much this year either. But he's got Harry Kane, Sadio Mane, Dele Alli, Real Mahrez, Fabinho, Emmerich Laporte, Robertson, and I didn't get to see the other few players. But his team is not the best, so hopefully we can go in and take a dub this game. No, not like this. He just did a time finesse. 
Jeez, okay, okay. I forgot to put a fitness card on. I forgot to put a fitness card on. I'm an absolute scrub. This game is gonna be hard. This, oh my God, I'm an idiot. How did I, how, why didn't you guys let me know to put a fitness card on? Like, I'm actually mad. Oh, that's good, that's good work. Carrasco! Oh, brilliant dribbling. I'll give him that, but he took way too long to shoot that ball. I don't know why. See inside. Cut back. Watch the inside again. Watch the inside again. Don't let him far post. He near posted it. That's a good goal, man. This guy's a good player. We'll give him that. I'm not trying to lose my first game at foot champs. I don't know why I went to foot champs, but hey, you got to compete best of the best, right? Even though foot champs is never actually the best of the best in the beginning. But you never know. You can get uh, lucky sometimes and get, uh, or you can get unlucky and get really good opponents. But we should be winning this game, man. Into Carrasco. Cut back. Come on, Carrasco. Let's see what you can do. I didn't mean to do that move, guys. I promise. That's a foul. I was trying to do a heel to heel. Can we take a free kick here with Carrasco? Let's see what happens. Um, I'm not liking this at all. Like, I don't even know what I'm going to do here. I'll be honest. I'll be honest. I have no idea what I'm going to do here. Like, that was so weird. All right, this guy's like pressing me. It's, okay, just keep the ball. Ref, he's literally getting pulled. That, that, that's weird. I have no idea what the hell just happened there. And then what is this, a free kick? How is he gonna get a free kick? Uh, I don't, I, I don't know. My guy just got pulled and I have no idea what just happened with the keeper. I'm assuming one of my players like attacked him or something. Oh, brilliant work, Carrasco. All right, just keep the ball, switch it up. Into Verone. Come on. What is this passing? What is this? I probably look like a... Literally, I look like a horrible FIFA player. I'll tell you that right now. Oh my god. What am I trying to do? I, I'm trying to force it too much here, man. I shouldn't be trying to force it. Alright, come on. Alright, let's see what we got. Come on. What's the call offside there? I'm pretty sure. All right, there we go. Michael Lilly into Veron. I I don't know what's going on here. Why does this game feel so sluggish and so slow? Come on, Carrasco. I mean, never mind. The Carrasco should have went to the ball there. Either way, it's halftime. Uh, right now, we are literally getting dominated in every single stat, pretty much. Uh, actually, besides possession, so we have a majority of possession, but he's he's beating us on shots on target and regular shots, but. I'm confident that we can get back in this game, but we just need one goal. Wow. Wow. This guy's good. Clear that out of here. All right, Dries Mertens, you need to turn up. You and Carrasco, the Bel if you guys didn't notice either, the name of my team was Belgian Chocolate. So these, these guys, the Belgian Chocolates, need to score. They need to come here. They need to turn up, and they need to score goals. All right, Carrasco. Keep it to Mbappe. Mbappe. Oh. Unlucky. That was good work from Carrasco, but we should have scored that, man. Carrasco. Play wide to Mbappe. What is that pass? Why did he put so much on that? This is difficult. This is really difficult. He's trying to just... What is this guy doing? It's the 64th minute. All right, we need to make a big change. We're going to put in constant pressure. We're going to we're gonna make some changes here. We're going to put Rashford in. question is, do I want him on the left side or the right side? So we're going to put Leo Messi. Uh, excuse me. So we're going to put Messi. We're going to put Rashford. And we're going to put in Ibra because we need to change this game. We really need to change this game. We have 20 minutes left. We just need to get back into this, and we need to try to do our best to get some goals because we're getting wrecked right now. Come on. Constant pressure. Switch it up. Carrasco. Into Ibra. Into back into Carrasco. Come on. Continue that run, Ibra. Ibra. Vamos, Ibra. Go so an assist from Carrasco there. You saw that his pace and his stamina was definitely al not allowing him to get, like, make the run and continue the run in behind. But good work. We subbed on Ibra, and then Carrasco gets a goal immediately. So I'm liking that. Let's take a look at the replay real quick. Good finish from Ibra. Good shot power. Perfectly timed. And let's see if we can get one more back. All right, come on. Are you, are you kidding me? 
I get that's Falcao, but Baresi had everything there. The positioning, everything. This is why Baresi is not there. Baresi's only in here for Kem, guys. He's honestly better as an outside back, even though he doesn't have the pace. Back post. Time it perfectly. I thought I timed that perfectly with Messi, but clearly the game thinks otherwise. This guy, this guy trashed us. Let's just be honest. He he trashed us. He beat us first game. He came back and got possession in the second half. But Carrasco, it's funny. Carrasco was actually my best player, which is hilarious. Uh, tie, joint tied with Ibrahimovic. He got an assist in this game, but not enough from Carrasco. So let's take a look and let's see what this guy's going to have. So he's got upgraded Rashford, um, UCL Sterling, Anthony Martial, not even the upgraded one, Fabinho. He's got future star Phil Foden, Kante, Aspiliqueta. Walker, David Luiz, Alexandro, and interesting with Casillas and Nep. Because Casillas is small and he's not even on full chemistry. So I'm sure we can win this game. I'm sure of it. Come on. Come on, Carrasco. Yanni Carrasco. Let's test out this dribbling. Yanni Carrasco. Oh, he just needed to do one more player. Ref, penalty. Carrasco. Let's go. Penalty. Yannick Carrasco, brilliant dribbling. All right, should we take it with him? I'm thinking we should take it with him. Kyle Walker, come on, bro. You can't be doing that. That's dirty, man. Honestly, there's nothing. There's not much in that, but uh, we're going to take it with Carrasco. We probably shouldn't be doing this, but we're going to take it anyway with him. No, I went to the left. Look, look. That's that's some BS. That's some BS. That's some cheese, man. I don't know. I don't know what that is. Oh my god, I'm actually pissed off. It's okay, Carrasco. Uh, that's not your fault. That's I guess I just didn't flick it in time, even though I definitely did. It just didn't register for some odd reason. Not gonna lie, the, the servers feel a little slow. Are they always slow like this early on like, uh, what is it today, uh, Friday? Are they always slow like this? Carrasco. Carrasco left foot again! Okay. Okay, now we're talking. This is what I like to see, Gianna Carrasco. Brilliant. Now we're talking. Good finish. 85 shooting coming into play, plus whatever attribute detail we added on, or the chem style we added on, what was it, the finisher. So, definitely, I don't know if they, if, if we didn't have that on, if it would have been a goal or not, but that's a brilliant finish. Let's take a look at that bottom right-hand corner with his weak foot. You know, I'm starting to think maybe we should play him on the right side, too, because he's very good at this. So, let's take a look. Hopefully, we can bag in some more goals with Carrasco. Alright, Carrasco again. Time for Ness. How Carrasco is on the ball here, I have no idea. Carrasco! Woo! Carrasco, can we see your... Can we test out your passing? Test out your passing. What a ball that is, Nakata. Finish this, Nakata. Wow! Wow, he moved his goalkeeper. I was not expecting that, but on top of him moving his goalkeeper, did you see how bad that shot was, Nakata? I'll be honest. Like, I understand the time frame for perfectly timing shots are so, like different now in this game but it's just it doesn't make sense to me because like i feel like the same shot that if i would have done that with mbappe or ibra it would have been perfectly timed so that's what i don't understand Michael there he's so open now brilliant work bressy just keep possession keep it there we go donny alves you gotta win that header man good work nakata why are you trying to head that ball i was waiting until you brought it down i'm not liking this man i'm not liking it I wasn't liking that. I had a feeling. I had a feeling, boys, that he was going to score some stupid some stupid stuff like that. Fernando Torres. I mean, Fernando Torres does have 91 shooting, so, I mean, I'll understand it. But that was, like, right down the middle of the goal. So, what is Courtois doing here? It deflected, but, like, it didn't even deflect, like, outwards or to a different direction that Courtois... Like, Courtois was there, and he didn't even attempt to make it. I guess he was blinded, but, like, I don't think blindness and stuff like that affect FIFA. Like, I, I don't know. But we'll, we'll, we'll get back into it. It's okay. I'm playing horrible FIFA, man. Horrible FIFA by me. Horrible FIFA. Jesus Christ. I'm raging. I am raging right now. I hope you guys are enjoying this because I'm playing so bad. I've never played this bad in a long, long time. I'll be honest. All right, so we're going to have to rage and take out Mertens because he's not doing anything. We're going to have to put on Rashford for, I'd say, Nakata. And then we can bring on Messi. 
but I feel like David Luiz is going to be the game changer in this game. As crazy as it might sound, I think I need David Luiz over Baresi. I need David Luiz in there. I need him winning tackles. I need him uh, giving me another aerial threat off of corner kicks just like uh, Ibrahimovic can. And then hopefully we can come and do something because right now we're just playing horribly. Carrasco! Oh! Off the bar, man. Good work, Carrasco, though. We'll, we'll give him that. We'll give you that. That's good work. Carrasco again! Vamos. Okay, good finishing. I mean, yeah, good finishing, but good positioning is what I meant to say by Carrasco. So that's, what is it, two goals this game? So he's definitely a good, good finisher. He's good inside the box. But I don't know if he's better as a striker, if he's better as a cam, because his passing is... It, it, like it is incredible. I can't even. I can't even lie. Vamos a la playa. A mí me gusta bailar. We're not gonna get a kickoff goal scored on us, but apparently we could have scored a kickoff goal ourselves, but then we didn't. I don't know what the hell I'm saying. You guys are probably like, what? Thinking I'm an idiot. But come on, Rashford. Whoa! I, I meant to play that to Rashford, boys. I swear, Ibra near post. Ibrahimovic is the real deal. Ibrahimovic? Zlatan Ibrahimovic? <laughs> Lions do not compare themselves with humans. I have, I, I have a horrible Ibrahimovic accent, but then again, that was a brilliant finish for him. Because I saw in the whole entire beginning of the game, this guy would always like go towards the far post. He didn't move his keeper there, but normally he would go towards his far post, and I had to hear, hit him with the near post. But brilliant, brilliant work from Carrasco. I think Carrasco got the assist there. I swear to God that I meant to play it to Rashford, but it played it to uh, Ibra. And I'm not complaining, so I think that's dumb, but I'm not complaining. I can't complain. Oh, Carrasco. I tried to play it off. I literally tried to play it off towards the wings. All right, come on, Varane. This is where you got to earn your pay. David Luiz, get back. This is why you brought onto the game. Good work, David Luiz. Clear that. Bravo. Bravo. Wow, that guy's huge. David Luiz again. See, David Luiz. <laughs> what? I'll take him all day over Baresi. No, 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 no. Not like this. Not like this. Not like this. Courtois. <laughs> Courtois doesn't even deserve to be a 90 rated keeper, I swear, man. The only reason why he's good sometimes is because of his height. But look at that. He can't save anything. I swear, keepers are so bad in this game. This is this is a rage episode. You guys are just going to see me rage here. Come on, Carrasco. Vamos, papá. Vamos, papá. Carrasco, use his strength. All right, come on, ref. Give me that foul. Come on. Let's play it short. Play it short. Ibrahimovic. All right, we got to find... Whoa, 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 whoa. This guy's dirty. This guy's dirty. We're on there, but it kind of happened. Shoot the ball! That's my own fault. I was sprinting there. If I wasn't sprinting, he would have had a better opportunity to finish the ball off there. But like, if I look, if I would have just slowed it down there and then shot it and used all my power, for some reason, if you try to time shots when you're running or when you're sprinting, they just don't. They're not as accurate. I don't know why. It makes sense because in, in real life football, it's like that. But then again. Like, sometimes when you're that close, if you're six yards in the box, like, that should not be happening. That should be flying in towards the roof of the net and the goalies in this game. Oh, don't let him have another opportunity. This guy wants to go into overtime. He does not want to just attack. He doesn't want to attack me. He's afraid. This guy's afraid, man. He's like, oh, I got so lucky to be in the position that I am today. He already knows that if I was using my better team, he would get smacked. 14 shots, 6 on target by us. We have 57% possession to his 43%. And we're dominating the game, but we should be winning. Well, I no no more. I've, I think I've already said this. No more, Mr. Nice Guy. We gotta we gotta sh we just gotta take this guy. We gotta pick him up. Gotta take him like this. Just gotta fucking destroy him. That's what we gotta do. All right, Carrasco. Carrasco. Oh, unlucky man. Carrasco is doing well this game. I'll be honest, but he's got to finish. Wow, Carrasco almost got his head on that. Yannick Carrasco. Carrasco! Well, come on, Carrasco. You gotta be finishing that, man. What is it, offside from Ibrahimovic? Yeah. But Carrasco's gotta be finishing that. If he's getting an eye, yes, maybe I should have not tried a low driven. But his shot power is, like, it's strong enough and it should be scoring that. But yeah, I could have tried, like, a finesse to the far post. Maybe he would have scored like that, but I don't know what's going on, man. This Carrasco just, he, he, he's, not, he's, not the, he's not the most clinical of finishers. I'll tell you that. 
You can't be serious. You can't be serious. You can't be serious. How is that ball getting through like that? I really gotta take a look at this replay. I, I've never been so mad at FIFA. Normally, if I was like mad after the first game, I'd have just taken a break, like realize there's button delay and everything like that, and just taking a break. But how? what is David Luiz doing? Why isn't David Luiz at least making an attempt? I understand if he doesn't even get there, whatever. He might have not gotten there, but like he's got to at least try to get there, you know? Carrasco, if you don't score this, man, thank you. Thank you. It's a kickoff goal. Yes, it's cheesy, but we needed it. We need to get a goal back. Is that a hat trick for him this game? So I can't tell if it's me with Carrasco's finishing or if it's just Carrasco's finishing is on and off because sometimes he feels really good on the finish and sometimes it just doesn't. So maybe it's me because I haven't learned his card yet and learned how to shoot from different angles. And But the thing is, I've had so many opportunities this game with Carrasco. Like If you go back and watch everything or if you count... You guys can just notice and just tell that Carrasco has had way so like way too many opportunities. All right, Zlatan Ibrahimovic, come on! Thank you, Zlatan. This is why you're there, man. We it's, it's moments like these that we need you. It's moments like these that we need you. I'm so thankful for you, Zlatan. You've earned your you you have earned the right to be in this team. You should be starting. I'll be honest with you. In my normal team, he does start, but thank you for saving the the day, Zlatan. Thank you. Much appreciated. If there are any challenges that you guys want me to do, like any like bronze team in weekend league, I might not do that. But silver teams, any specific team, like maybe a Liverpool team in the weekend league, or a uh, just any team, it doesn't really matter. Any challenges or anything you guys have, let me know in the comments down below if you have uh, ideas, and I'll add them to the list. So three goals from Carrasco this game, along with two goals from Ibra. Uh, who has the assist? One goal from Carrasco and one from Ibra as well. So Carrasco with three goals and one assist this game. That's incredible. I can't even like I'm uh, like. That that's great, like incredible from Yannick Carrasco, but he's definitely got his finishing does not seem like it's a hundred percent up to par. One more game, hopefully he can completely prove me wrong and prove everything that I've said in the past couple games absolutely wrong. So let's see what he's got. All right, final opponent. Let's see, he's got wow. So he's got the Europa League road to the final. What is it, Jared Rome, uh, Ro Romero? Jared Moreno. Jared Moreno. He's got uh, informed Dembele, Malcolm, Saul Niguez. He's got Partey, he's got Artur, he's got Marcelo, Raul Jimenez, Langley, De Marcos, and Neto in net. So, not, again, not a strong team again, but probably a really good opponent. Carrasco, vamos! There we go. That's what I'm talking about, Carrasco. I'm, I'm getting the hang of him now. I'm starting to get the hang of him. Brilliant first touch in behind. That 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 was brilliant. I'll give I'll give him that. I'll give him that. I'm li I'm liking that. I like that a lot. We completely outdid him with the first touch there and a brilliant finish to the far post. Come on, Carrasco. You got to get back some more goals this game. Come on. What a play. What a play. Brilliant positioning from Carrasco. Br brilliant play from Dries Mertens. I wasn't Honestly, that ball was awesome by me. That ball in behind the Mertens, they just squared all back off to back to Carrasco into Carrasco again. Ref, that's a penalty kick. Good work from Carrasco. Hopefully we can actually get Carrasco the penalty this game and actually score it. I'm going to go in the exact same spot, and I will show you guys on camera that we actually went that way. So he's pointing to where I'm going to go. All right, so hopefully we're going to go up, right? And then we're going to go left. Wow, good save. So his penalties are not that good. We'll be honest. I tried to get that more in the corner. That was my own fault. Maybe it's because I tried to do it on camera. But, um... What's going on here? Why is it lagging? But uh, don't take your pen don't take penalty kicks with Carrasco. If you decide to do this league SPC, don't do it. Don't take your pens with Carrasco. He's not that good. I think he only has like seventy penalty kicks, if I'm not mistaken. We're dominating again. This guy doesn't even have a shot. Not even a shot. We have eight shots with six on target. Fifty-eight percent possession to his forty-two percent. Come on, Carrasco should be getting more goals. I really want some chocolate. I really want some chocolate. Oh, I tried to I tried to do a locker kit that around the keeper. I, I could have just scored that. I'll be honest, I could have just scored that, or at least I could have shot the goal, uh, shot the ball to make sure at least I even had an opportunity. But I was trying to be fancy. I thought he was gonna bring the goalkeeper out. Like I said, I wanted Belgian chocolate. So like, if I would have just if I would have just shot the ball regularly there, I would have gotten some regular chocolate. But if I would have like did him like that, that would have been some nice Belgian chocolate. You know, if I would have scored from that angle 
or if I would have done went around. You know, we gotta we gotta go up in the world sometimes. But unlucky, good play though. Just trying to like test out some stuff. You know, you guys already know. Carrasco, time finesse. So lucky. I think that's that's gotta be an own goal, right? It's probably an own goal. I don't know if it is or not, but oh no, it's not considered an own goal, but. That was very, very lucky for being honest. But hey, sometimes you gotta you gotta shoot to like at least get an opportunity. If you get luck, if you get lucky, you get lucky. But a goal at the end of the day, a goal is a goal. So some fancy Ibra Carrasco. Oh, if that would have went in. That would have been so hilarious. I, guys, please don't get mad at me. This opponent is not that good. And, like, I'm not trying to show, but I'll be honest, I'm not trying to show, but at all. I could just keep scoring goals, but, like, I'm not, I wouldn't be having fun if I just kept trying to score goals. Um, if I, if I were to be 100% honest with you, what the, what the, what the, what the, what the hell just happened there? I have no idea, but Carrasco, um, I think he got, what, a hat trick this game, if I'm not mistaken? Yeah, he got a hat trick here. Um, who got the assist? Just curious. Wait. Oh, there's literally Mertens and Nakata got all three. I was wondering who had the third assist because I only saw Nakata got the first two, but Mertens is on the bench. But another hat trick from Carrasco. So let's go take a look, and I'll let you guys know how he did in all the games, show you all of his stats, all the goals, the yellow cards, the assists, and then we'll talk about that in a minute. Okay, so in three games, Yannick Carrasco got six goals and two assists. I'll be honest, that those are actually those look like some really, really nice stats. I don't think he got a goal in the first game, but he got like what two hat tricks, if I'm not mistaken. I know he got a hat trick for sure, or hundred percent certain that he got one in the last game. I think he got one in the second game too, and no goals in the first game. But I, I'm not don't quote me on that. I'm not hundred percent sure. But he's got he like two assists, as I already said, really good passing. So let's jump into it. His cons. I'll be honest, man. I don't know if it's his finishing is a con or not, but I would say maybe his composure because he does not finish everything. For the amount of opportunities he got, he probably could have gotten twice as many amount of goals. So I'd say finishing is definitely a little low, but he makes up for it in the amount of opportunities he's able to create, and his attack position is also good. So I'd say cons, I'd say maybe his, his strength, right? So his strength is going to be a little bit low. His stamina, and I'm going to say just his finishing. Everything else about the card is uh, is really good. So let's jump straight into the pros now. So I very much like how he, this guy actually has four-star skill moves compared to Jovic's three-star skill moves yesterday, but that's not going to be a pro. The pro here that's going to be in this card is going to be his dribbling. His number one pro is hands down his dribbling. The way this guy just is able to break off of defenders and just skid left and right, the way he's able to just glide past defenders with his first touch is also incredible. So his dribbling is insane. His pace, you definitely notice his pace. I wouldn't say it's necessarily a pro, but you definitely notice his pace. His shooting, the thing is, his shooting is insane. It's weird because it's like a, it's a pro and a con at the same time because his shooting is actually really, really good, but you see that by face value, and sometimes he does things that you're just like, wow, incredible. I don't think his long shots are that good, right? His long shots are very low. I mean, yes, I put plus 13 on him, but you guys notice that you can see that his long shots are just not that good. His shot power should go up to 99, which is why he should be scoring a little bit more. So his shooting is definitely going to be, oh, it's a pro and a con at the same time, so I'll say his shooting is a pro and his con is finishing. 100%. So we'll go with that. And then another thing that I could say is definitely a pro about this card is that he has really good passing. So you can play him as a striker, as a central attacking midfielder. Those are his best positions right there. Um, now, overall rating. The moment we've all been waiting for. Can we get a drum, a drum roll, please? Could you imagine? I, I'm not, never mind. I'm not going to do that shit. But then again, Let's see what he's going to get out of 10. I'm going to give him, I'm going to make this up to, off of the top of my head. Normally I have notes, like normally I'll be like, oh, he got an 8.5. Normally I say his pros are this and this and that and that, which is why it seems not as fluid today because normally I'm reading off of the piece of paper. But I want to make this a little bit more raw, a little bit more free-flowing. So I'm going to give Carrasco out of 10. I'm going to give him an 8.5 out of 10 because, look, he he's an incredible player. You could probably play him at Cam. He's a versatile player. He's 5'11". But then again, he's, his height, he doesn't have good heading. But he's a really, really good player. It, what would bring him up to a 9 or a 9.5 is if he would have gotten 8 or 9 goals in those games. Because, like I said, the beginning of foot champions, you never know who you're going to play. Most likely, you're not going to be playing the best opponents. But if I was playing in division rivals, the opponents would definitely be tougher. But that's not the case, as you guys can see. So that's why, in my opinion, I think he should have scored more goals. But he's a very, very good player. Uh, the league SBC for around 100 and. 15k or whatever it's going for right now, I think it's definitely worth it. This Karaska card is definitely worth it. If you're trying to create a Belgian 
Division team, maybe get Drees Mertens or Kevin De Bruyne in there or Eden Hazard, whoever you want to bring in there. Uh, whoever, what other Bre- Be- ever, what, <laughs> whatever other Belgian chocolates you want to bring in there. I really hope you guys don't take offense to that because I just really love Belgian chocolates. But that's going to be the end of the video today. So if you did like it, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and peace out.